All right, people. Hey, Dick Pearsall, do you like women? Oh, Dick Pearsall loves the ladies. Well, right here and now, Whitley and Crystal are about to have an arm wrestling match. Oh, this oh, will be crazy. Oh, believe me, I'm very excited, Jacoby Jones. I took an extra shower, throw on a little extra cologne. Oh, I can't wait to see these two ladies up close. Oh, well, there she is, the cousin of the A-team. Her name is Whitley. And she has some serious, serious beef with Crystal. Tonight, they get to maybe settle those differences in an arm wrestling match. Whitley. Downtown Whitley Brown. And I love the outfit. Oh, oh. Jacoby Jones. Well, it's not too often that women get the spotlight here in TWF. But and I'm all for it. Oh, no. You know who my, my heart goes out. Oh, if there was one chick that Dick Pearsall wants to ravish, and I said ravish, it is that luscious beauty right there, Crystal. Well, Crystal, the girlfriend of Ashton. Ashton's cool with me. The female spokesmodel of Famous Inc. They're young, they're famous, they're successful, and they never stop talking about it. Well, I know it says no men allowed, but Dick Pearsall's gonna cruise out there to get a closer look at these two lovelies. Oh, really? Here we go. Sexy. How dare Tara kick me out of there, Jacoby Jones. All I want to get close to him. All men are banned from ringside, Dick Pearsall. This, my friends, is an arm wrestling contest between two women that hate each other's guts and Crystal. I'm just hoping some blouses get ripped. Well, here we go. Oh, look at that strength. Obviously, Crystal might be the stronger of the two, but don't underestimate Whitley. Look at this. Come back. Showing some. Oh, not quite. Intensity. Hold on. Oh, no. It could be an upset. Oh, look at that. Wait a second. That's Ashton. Ashton just played his music, it distracted Whitley, and Crystal gets a tainted, <laughs> tainted, tainted win. Hey, a win's a win. my opinion, people out there, and Dick Pearsall to my right, all that did was add fuel to the fire as far as these women are concerned. Hey, it was, oh, look at that. It was an arm wrestling match, and the stronger participant won, period. No, that no, woman right there, No, Crystal. the cheating, conniving, <laughs> backstabbing participant won. Nothing settled here. Arm wrestling contest. Watch this. 
Yeah, booze for you, woman. They're all jealous. Well, here we go. Look at this. Whitley was about to win. Whitley had turned the corner over the top like Sylvester Stallone. But look at this. Music starts blaring for no apparent reason, and Whitley <laughs> loses. Crystal wins. One of the things you have to keep your concentration in arm wrestling. You know that. All right. Well, unpredictability does happen at TWF Live Shows. This Saturday is TWF Sadistic. It's Saturday, the 11th of October. Colonial Theater, 3522 Stockton Boulevard in Sacramento. Doors at 7. Show starts at 7.30. You got to come see us do our thing live. Sadistic, always one of the best shows of the year. You do not want to miss it. All right. Let's run down the card here tables ladders and chairs six men duke it out six man tag raz vortex and craig take on sick case anxiety and steel damn also tv title on the line scorpion tries to take that strap from joey balls not gonna happen the crown jewel ain't gonna give it up also, CJ Prophet versus Jack Moves singles competition, special referee, the immortal one himself, Anthrax. What's on Anthrax's mind? Rob Banks and Ashton will also duke it out. Anthrax will referee that thing. Remember when Famous Sing took him out? Ha! Sparks are going to fly. We'll see what's up. Also on the card, the Jake needs two partners, not one, but two, to take on Morrow's mercenaries. Who will survive? Does he have two friends? I don't even know if he has one friend. What the hell? This is Ben Vortex and Exorcist. This is... George, this You heard the music. Oh, there we go. Earlier at Head On Collision, they shocked the world. Ashton and CJ Prophet shocked the world. Opportunists that they are and won the tag titles of TWF. That click right now is hotter than the rolling dice, Jacoby Jones. You can't argue with gold. They are the tag team champions of TWF. I'll give them credit. When it took a dirty lowdown way to win, when it took an opportunity, when it took luck, it took everything under the sun to do it, but somehow, some way they did. But guess what? Yeah, they got the belt. That's your biased opinion, Jacoby. This is our celebration. Our celebration. I think in the business they call that white hot heat. These people do not like Famous <laughs> Inc. and rightfully so. They hate what they cannot be. Great. Okay, it's one thing to be young and successful and glamorous and good looking, blah, blah, blah. It's another thing to rub it in people's faces every second of the day. Hey, it's called soaking up the glory. You earned it. Enjoy it. It's called being humble. Bandit, 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 <laughs> They're on top of the world, Jacoby. Yes! Okay. 
A-team! It's the A-team! Well, look at manager Crystal writing a check that perhaps the new champs can't cash! Oh my god! And the A-team are taking these guys out! She opened the challenge and it might come back to bite her! Oh no! Oh! They're calling for a ref! No! New, new champs! I, mean, I can't believe this. What? Did that just happen? The A-Team are the new tag team champions of TWF! Oh, quicker than you can say, Crystal opened her big mouth. The A-Team are the tag team champions. Jack Moves and Rob Banks just got their first taste of gold in TWF thanks to the big mouth of Crystal. She just put her foot in her mouth, and boy, is she going to pay. Wow, just as quick as they rose to the top, Jacoby. Look at this. The A-Team are the tag team champions. Crystal declared they could beat anyone at any time. An open challenge, if you will. Harris says it's official. Wow. Of course she would. She's crooked. She hates famous thing. Look at I'm, he's heart. The cocky cover boy's heartbroken, Jacoby. Come on. Oh. Oops, and she must feel two inches tall right now. The celebration is on. Their fans love it. Everyone in this damn building loves it. The A-Team have outsmarted Famous Inc. and walked away with the tag titles of TWF. Damn it. Destiny fulfilled. Thank you very much. What happened? I know what happened. <laughs> we all know what happened. We're catching our breath here. Crystal had told the world that they could beat anyone at any time. An open challenge, if you will. And the A-team answered. Double Irish whip. Famous Inc. was completely and totally flabbergasted by this assault. Down he went. Oh, down went Ashton. A three count later from a referee that Famous Inc. spent years picking on. And guess what? Impromptu, done, finito, brand new tag team champions kiss the reign of Famous Inc. goodbye because the era of the A-Team has arrived in tag team wrestling. Man.
I don't think Crystal realized as manager she has that right to give an open challenge. Man, I cannot believe that. I don't know oh. the legalities of the issue. I am not a lawyer, Dick Pearsall, but I do know that the commissioner's opinion stands, and we've got new tag team champions. There we go. All right, well, we've got TV shows listed on the left, internet destinations listed on the right. I think I'm too out of breath from what just happened to, uh, to say them all out loud, but I will say, if you're just joining in, you missed the crowning of new tag team champions. It was that exciting. It was that quick, too. One minute, the famous ink on top of the mountain. Um, I can't believe it. Well, we're getting ready for the main event of Head on Collision. We're getting ready for the last man standing match. But let me tell you, we're trying to shuffle our cards here. This is crazy. All right. This Saturday, TWF Sadistic Live Wrestling. You're going to show up this Saturday at the Colonial Theater. October 11, 3522 Stockton Boulevard in Sacramento. Doors at 7. Show starts at 730. They got to show up. You want to get there early, get the best seat. It's always one of the best shows in town. If you know anybody that's ever gone to a TWF live show, just ask them because they'll say, I can't believe it. It took me two hours just to pry my jaw off the floor. Definitely so. Watching us do our thing live is unlike anything else on this planet. Well, what's going to happen? Three letters, TLC, tables, <laughs> ladders, and chairs, Raz Vortex and Craig take on sick case anxiety and Steel Johnson. It will be insane. Office Max is going to be short a few supplies that night. Also on the card, Scorpion challenges Joey Balls for the television championship. Can the monster walk away with the gold? He has about as much chance prying gold away from Joey Balls as Ron Rufio does winning a spelling bee. Oh, <laughs> Also, CJ Profit and Jack Moves, the whole complexion of that match just took another crazy turn. Anthrax will be the special guest ref, but CJ won't walk in with that 10 pounds of tag team gold. Oh, he's going to walk in with a big chip on his shoulder. Definitely so, and also, Rob Banks and Ashton meet one-on-one. -on -one. Ashton will not be holding that shiny belt on his shoulder in that picture. Plus, Anthrax is the referee. He, uh, he might be looking for some payback for what Famous Inc. did to him. Who knows what's on Anthrax's mind, but we'll find out morrow's mercenaries lockjaw mike omega and chris Ar cardenas three men on a mission to destroy twf one man to defend it the jake and two partners of his choosing morrow too smart to let this pass by main event now Last man standing, Vortex versus Ecstasy, the world champion versus the number one contender. It don't get no bigger, and it is now. I can't wait. I'm going to go hang with my man, Ecstasy. I'll see you in a little bit. Maybe the best pure athlete in the 10-year glorious history of this company. Maybe the most potential of any star on the roster. Maybe destiny tonight. There are professional athletes all over the sports world. 